Hello everyone, Ben here. Today I just wanted to show you how you can visualize your FPS inside the Fusion Fall game. For that, you are going to need the Steam Store app. This one right here. Once you have it, you go sim you simply go to library, select in the left bottom corner add a game, add a non-Steam game, and you will see all these applications popping up. That's all your applications registered in your computer. You simply scroll down a little bit until you find Fusion Fall Universe. You check the mark right here and select the button that says Add Selected Programs. Once you have it right here, all you have to do is create a desktop shortcut. Once you've done that, you will always open the game with Steam. If you don't do this and you simply try to open the game as normally, you will not have the FPS feature, that's because you are not opening the game with Steam. Doing this, every time you double click your desktop icon, is going to open the Fusion Fall universe that is that is linked to Steam. Okay, once we're here, all you have to do is click on Steam right here and Settings. You go to In-Game Settings, and right here where it says In-Game FPS Counter, you select wherever you want it, top left, top right, bottom right, or bottom left. I just have it on, on top left. Once you select this, all you have to do is click OK and open your game. You can click on play or open your desktop shortcut. Once you click on play, you will see that it always loads Steam at first. Here's your launcher, all you have to do is play the game like normally and you always be, be playing like that. Let's see how long it takes to open. Once you are past this screen, you will see the FPS counter right here. There you go. Right in the left top corner, I have my FPS. What do you think? 64 FPS, 95 FPS. Because I'm recording, the FPS are a little lower. I'm usually around 130 FPS. That's all you have to do. I hope you enjoyed this video and give it a try. This is a, an easy way and a, I think it, it is a perfect way to see your FPS without being a bother in your screen. Because as you can see, it's really small right here in the top left corner. So that's it, hope you all like it and give it a try, see you next time!